probably unceded territories. It, there's a lot of other things about British Columbia, but like that kind of is the root of it, is unceded territories. Sun Sea Coast. Because I think two beautiful attributes of BC, as we now know it, is the sun and the sea. So if I could rename British Columbia, I think I'd try and take away all the colonial um, remnants that that name leaves and get rid of anything to do with British, especially in it coming from a British person. Uh, I would rename BC Island Mountain. Um, I'd probably define um, British Columbia as a place, a territory that needs to be culturally and geographically reimagined um, for the people that own this land. I would not rename it at all because I'm from Saskatchewan and I'm a visitor to British Columbia, or to this province, whatever name it ends up with. And it would be no more correct for me to suggest a name for this place than it was for the original Europeans who invaded the place to give it a name. I would encourage it to be renamed, uh, not renamed, but renewed as Aboriginal title land. I think that should be up to maybe some sort of committee or a group who can get together and sort of come up with a name that will represent the people of this land and not, you know, British Columbia. The, the naming of British Columbia has uh, long been a question for Aboriginal people. Joining the Confederation of Canada, this is native land. 96% of this province is non-treaty. So let's change the name of British Columbia to uh, traditional native lands. This is why I'm asking for the change because Canada doesn't own this province. We've never surrendered it. It belongs to all native people in this province. and. Their nations have to be recognized, not uh, not British Columbia.